move over tequila. Everybody knows tequila in the US, but Mezcal seems to be like kind of coming on the scene. Tequila has to be made with blue Weber agave, okay. whereas Mezcal can be made with 50 species of agave. Now, the one thing I know about Mezcal is it's got a smoky or smokier taste. You get that smokiness from the cooking process. They're cooking over fire pits, so you are getting that incorporated flavor profile. We stopped by Renata's Hearth at the Arizona Biltmore to learn three recipes from Mezcal Maven Tara O'Connor, starting with a burnt paloma. I like to use a little tahine and then smoked malt on sea salt mixed okay. together. All right, fancy. Um, so we're gonna do half an ounce of lime juice. Okay. And we're gonna do 0.75 ounces of grapefruit juice. I'm also gonna use pamplemousse, which oh, is French for grapefruit. <laughs> French for grapefruit, yeah. <laughs> grapefruit liqueur. So. Oh. It right. gives it a little sweetness, but just kind of rounds out that grapefruit flavor. For the mezcal. I'm using Ryu, which is a Hoven mezcal. Hoven means young. Shake everything over ice. <laughs> that is more fun than a shake weight. I like that. That's it really is. cool. Pour in a glass, top with club soda, and garnish with a torched grapefruit slice. The moment of truth. This drink didn't lie. This is the <laughs> truth. Tara's next cocktail, Margarita Verde, combines lime juice and cilantro syrup. I make my own cilantro syrup. Okay, a little cilantro yeah, syrup, so I, I make, see you. I make a simple syrup and I blend it in a Vitamix with cilantro. Mm -hmm. Next, one of my favorite, it's called Antorreas and it's their Verde. It's a poblano chili liqueur. Whoa. Add mezcal, shake and serve straight up, and garnish it with a Fresno chili. Do people ever actually eat the pepper? Um, if you're daring, yeah. A Fresno chili isn't known to be spicy, but it can be. That's really good. I feel healthy because I've got vegetables <laughs> and a green drink. Our final drink, El Durazno, which means the peach, it's equal parts rye whiskey, peach liqueur, mezcal. And then we're gonna finish it off with a couple dashes of lemon bitters. Add ice, give it a stir, pour in a rocks glass, and garnish with a grapefruit peel. There is a perfect harmony right now. Like we're talking melody, not malice. I am so happy with that. this. Like I'm singing the praises of this drink. For the full recipes, head to thelisttv.com. Cheers to Mezcal Cocktails.